I got like four and a half hours of sleep last night. I'm in line for coffee and I'm heading to the studio. I haven't been in like three weeks and I was in the middle of working on a bunch of stuff. So I hope they haven't thrown my things away. I don't think they will. I'm so tired, but coffee's gonna help. Coffee will be good. <laughs> Good lord, I'm at the studio. I don't even know what time it is. It's probably right at 9 o'clock. So I'm going to drink some coffee in the, in, in the parking lot because evidently that's what I do. I am so tired. This is good. A lot of fly activity. I guess everybody's dropping their kids off or something. I don't know. And I need to stop mumbling. Anyway, this morning probably calls, but this is why I bring my oils with me, is because I have things like, oh my God, I don't have my energy in here. Ugh. All right, what do I have? Brain power. <laughs> brain power. I need brain power. Oh, these people are going to think I'm insane. All right, brain power. And clarity. Clarity. Clarity, 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 clarity. Okay. Mm. That's about as good as it's going to get without my energy. So, yeah. I hope they haven't thrown away all of my pots that I was working on. I don't think they would. I mean, it was a holiday. So, they know a lot of people are out of town. They know I was out of town. So, and they wouldn't do that. Hopefully. Alright, I'm going to go in and check. Here we go. <laughs> Check the hose with boughs of holly. Fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Done we now our gay apparel. Fa la 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 la. Troll the ancient yuletide cat. I'm done. <laughs> I took my time because I've been having major glaze issues with, with the ones that I make. And this woman even asked me, well, is it aggravating that you spend so much time on these faces and, and only to have them mess up? And I'm like, well, yeah, but that's all part of it. You know, it's, it's easy to make a sure thing, but this is different. I mean, I guess the, these mugs kind of embody what I want to do with the ceramics is I don't want to get into production. I want to make some art and not that there's anything wrong with doing production. A lot of people at the studio do a lot of production and it's, and their stuff is beautiful and it, they've got the exact, uh, you know, the perfect thing down and they're consistent. And I just, I don't, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not that consistent. I've got some ideas brewing for some more uh, weaving headers and uh, I'll be sketching those out soon and I'll share that process with you guys. I'm going to turn this off so I can roll down the window and or turn on the air conditioning and head home, have some lunch and, 
edit some video and weave on on that uh scarf heading home all right fiberistas so i'm i'm back in the studio and oh i'm fighting the friday yeah fridays sometimes sometimes i i like to take my fridays uh to be more like saturdays cuz i tend to work on sundays so i don't know I'm going to do a little bit of weaving. I'm not going to go to town and I've got video editing to do for because we're in the middle of Vlogmas and hopefully it won't take as long as yesterday's but yesterday's was a disaster with my app crash, crashing and spending a lot of time with customer support. I'm feeling tired because I didn't get a lot of sleep last night and whiny and want to take a nap. So. All right, I'm going to keep it short. This doesn't have to be a long vlog. Uh, so I'll just share a little bit of weaving and, and then get to editing and wrap this up. <laughs> All right, so I've taken a shower because I sat down to weave, wove a good bit, and my camera ran out of juice. And so it threw the whole weaving away. And so this is only day three of recording. Hopefully by day 25 I'll have this down pat. So now it's 4.30 and I need to start editing some video. Before the light gets too horrible for me to even show you guys anything, I'm just going to show you what I will want today. So as soon as my iPhone is done downloading the stuff, I'm going to just show you what I worked on earlier this afternoon. All right, here we go. Okay, so here's where I am so far, and I spent all kinds of time recording this, <laughs> and it didn't it didn't record. But anyway, which is probably just as well. Um, yesterday's recording, it, it it's pretty much the same type of stuff. The only thing about today, let's see, I started. I think I started somewhere around here and wove a little bit. You see, and, and I'm I'm doing some areas that are a little more dense and a little with some contrasty colors here. And then I I left one of those little areas with the with the yarn where it's where it's not woven and it shows off uh the texture a little more. It's gonna show off this, it's gonna show off you know this nice stuff and then and then here I added some more color a little bit of color there and it's and I tell you what I found that when here you know the the weaving it's kind of even but as you know once it's off the loom and as I wear it and as it moves around some of this will it'll just kind of naturally you know shift the the uh, weft will shift a little bit on itself, which is kind of fine. It it, it kind of uh, you know the weft tends to shift to go with the flow um, with the drape of the yarn. So anyway, I I think this really light uh, weaving with the with the lace weight yarn really kind of doesn't take away from the drape of of this too much. I mean it stiffens it just a little bit, but I think as like I said, as that weft moves around, it, it kind of gets that drape back in place. Now, and I get this question a lot. Um, for this kind of art weaving, I tend to, I tend to not full it. Um, you know, a lot of times with traditional weaving, once you take it off the loom, you full it. And this kind of thing, I, I probably won't. I might give it just a quick soak. But I kind of doubt it, only because this sorry, this sorry silk stuff tends to uh, tends to be really delicate. Um, so, you know, it's one of these scarves. It's not going to be a heavy wear scarf. I'm not going to wear it out jogging where it's going to get super sweaty or anything. So I just kind of treat it like a piece of just delicate wearable art. Um, so there you have it. All right. So yeah. <laughs> That's what I worked on today, and you can see I've got a good bit of, of the warp left to go. 
Um, but I'll probably do another section like this um, on the other end and just kind of keep on keeping on. So there it is. That's what I uh, worked on and uh, today. So there you have it. Okay, so it's only nine o'clock. I consider that a win. <laughs> I'm getting faster with the uh, with my video editing, so that's a good thing. Anyway, so I'm gonna sign off for tonight. <laughs> Let me just say I have the most patient husband ever because dinner's been kind of a. It's coming. Can we just have leftovers or let's pull something out of the freezer? Yeah. Anyway, so I'm getting better. I'm getting better. I'm, I'm hoping that by within the first week, maybe I'll be uploading the video before dark. So there you have it. Anyway. All right. So tomorrow I didn't finish that weaving. Um, so tomorrow I'll either work on that or I, I really have some ideas I want to sketch out. So maybe we'll do a little art journaling and I'll share with you some inspirations that I gathered when I was in Philadelphia. So anyway, all right. Good night, y'all. See you tomorrow.